to see Esteles. She seems to be asleep already. We could still talk tomorrow. Right. Why don't we all return to our rooms then? What's the matter, Repeat? Do you guys hear a strange sound? Now that you mention it, yeah. Oh, I've been hearing that the Barrier Blasty has been acting up lately. Hey, hold your horses. I can't. Commandant Alexei is there, isn't he? He should be able to take care of it. Rita, if we let you go out on your own, it'll be just another repeat of a Meat Hill. Well, if you want, we could at least let Flynn know about it. It's been a while since the Imperial Knights have interrogated me. Forgot how tiring it was. Even the Princess and His Highness Yoder got involved. <coughs> and two captains and the Commandant. And with Flynn here too, they're leaving the capital totally defenseless. Pretty sloppy work. some credit for once, will you? Please, Rita. All right, then. It's okay for you to be wandering around like this? Yes, but can I stay with you until it's time to return to Zophius? I don't mind at all. What do you think that scary monster we saw in Kerr Bakram was? That beast was way tougher than anything I've ever seen before. If it didn't run away when it did, we'd have been in a world of hurt. That's a surprisingly cautious opinion coming from you. Not that I disagree when it comes to a monster like that. Do you think it was the hunting blades who trapped it in a reverse barrier? Yeah, probably. It looked like they came to take that monster down. And whatever the case, I don't want to meet up with a monster like that again. has been making some odd noises. Do you think it's okay? You came all the way here because you were worried about that? As always, Yuri, you can't leave well enough alone if you see anything amiss. Hey, it's not me. She was the one that... It's obvious that something's not right with that Blastia. Let me have a look at it. This Blastia is currently in a state of repair. I'm sorry, but I cannot allow you to examine it. Why? that vibration don't tell me that was the blastia maybe something's happened to the blastia let's get out of here 
Your Highness, you must stay here. saying you prepare rooms at once I'll take her there myself Carol can you stand yeah come on we're going to can't keep using your healing arts on her forever, Esteles. Come on, let's let her rest for now. Yes. I can't believe she had to go and do something like that. Yes. Once Rita chooses to do something, she won't listen to anyone else. You're one to talk. You were just as bad as she was. I'm sorry. I'm gonna stay here. You should go rest. Aren't you tired from using your healing arts so much? I'm jealous of Rita. She has something she cares about so much. And so can you, if you spend enough time looking for it. But you need to go and get some sleep now. No, I'm fine. Yuri, you should get some sleep yourself. Flynn will get mad at me if you pass out. So let him get mad at you. Look, don't come asking me to take your place when you collapse from exhaustion. I can't ask you to take my place if I've already collapsed, can I?
first met me, and at Kerr Bakram, and today. I think everyone freaked out today. Even the great commandant was pretty in over his head. There are lots of things even grown-ups can't do. Even you, Yuri? Yeah, I guess so. It's a tough world. Now you got the idea. Hey, Yuri? Hmm? Do you think you'd want to maybe start a guild with me? A guild, huh? Yeah, that's an idea. I'll think about it. Really? What, you're surprised? I thought you'd say, no way! I've been in enough messes already! Or something. Not all adults think like that, you know. Anyway, it's late. Let's get some rest and see how she's doing in the morning. See you're awake. And after I told her over and over to call me before she collapses. You didn't think she'd really listen to you, did you? <sighs> she looks happy. Hey, so what do you think Estelise thinks of me? Why are you making that face? I just didn't think you were the kind of person who cared what other people thought. Forget it. You can go now. Compared to those formulas of yours, she should be easy to figure out. Huh? Huh? Rita! You're awake! But be careful. It's just when you think you've recovered that you're in the most danger. It's alright. I'm fine. Also, you don't need to pretend to be using that Blastia anymore. I... What do you mean? It's pretty cool that you can use healing arts without a Blastia. But... But how did you... What the... Hey, it's that dragon freak!
just when the conversation was getting interesting. That's enough talk about Estelle's healing arts for now. Fine by me. I've pretty much figured it out anyway. Don't look at me like that. Do I really look like that much of a bad guy to you? Yes. <laughs> hey, wait! What's going on, you guys? Come on, tell me! care on the way back to the capital. Okay. Do you have everything? Wouldn't want to have to come back later. If I forget anything, you'll bring it to me. Won't you, Yuri? <laughs> yeah, right. Okay, let's go find Flynn. I'll take you that far. Uh, um, what are you all gonna do after this? Hmm, well, we did lose track of the Blood Alliance. That's easy! We can just go to Dongrest. Or not. Man, if I go back there now, they'll all just laugh at me. Dongress? That's the Guild City, right? Yeah. I thought we could find out about the Blood Alliance there. What direction is it from here? Well, it's to the west, I guess, but... Let's check it out, then. It might be helpful for anybody thinking you're starting a guild, too. Huh? For starting a guild? Well, let's go, then. character is around here. Does that mean you're staying with us for now? Well, I... Would that be alright? Carol, don't fill the princess's head with ideas. You cannot simply do as you wish. Your Highness must return to the capital. Flynn has already set out to tend to other business. Now then, Rita Mordio, we would like you to investigate yesterday's Blastia malfunction. That's pointless. I looked at him this morning, but I couldn't figure anything out. No, we would ask that you go to the forest of Cave Mock. Cave Mock, huh? Oh yeah, the plants affected by the disaster here look just like the ones in that forest. We have reports of tree mutations, and of monsters increasing in both number and aggressiveness. Messengers have gone to the capital, but much time will be wasted finding a gifted mage. I specialize in Blastia. Plants are out of my league. Consider their connection to the air. I imagine that is within your league. Besides, I... If Estelle is going back to the capital, I want to go with her. What do you mean? You are a researcher in an Imperial Blastia laboratory. You must undertake the tasks assigned to you. Then there should be no problem if I accompany her to the forest, right? Princess, please do not make suggestions that are simply out of the question. If this does have something to do with air, then my healing arts would prove useful. Yes, they would. Please, Alexei. Let me do my part to help. Your Highness, I simply cannot allow you to go to such a dangerous forest. Well, what if... Yuri, would you come with us? Me? If Yuri were to come, you wouldn't be worried, right? Young man, please escort the princess. I ask this of you only because you once sought to join the Imperial Knights. Of all the underhanded... I didn't ask anybody to count on me. You're pushing me into this. It seems I can take that reply as indication of your agreement. But there's something I have to do as well. We go to the forest after Dungrist. Very well. 
Your Excellency. It seems Flynn foresaw this outcome. Huh? He did what? He left this message for you. Take care of Her Highness. All right, then. It's the Forest of Cavewalk by way of Dawngrest. I have a job for you. I'm glad that Commandant Alexei turned out to be so reasonable. Yeah, I thought he'd be more of a stubborn jerk myself. Had you met him before, Yuri? I knew him, but I doubt he knew me. I was barely in the nights for any time at all, really. What sort of person is he, I wonder? He can be very formal at times, but in a way, he's something of a symbol for the Knights. Many who are in the Knights now were inspired to join by Alexei's example. <laughs> One thing's clear. I don't have much in common with him. place well it's the second largest city after the imperial capital it's run entirely by the guilds i thought it'd be more dark and dank you know like a den of villains that's just a prejudice people have about the guilds i'm sure the bad reputation of the blood alliance is to blame for that yeah geez yuri you make it sound like i'm a villain if you're a villain what does that make him point taken so, how should we go about tracking down Barbos? The best way is probably to stop by the Union and check there. The Union. A guild collective run by the five so-called Master Guilds, right? Yeah. The Union also serves as the city's government. But how is this gonna work? Isn't Barbos's Blood Alliance one of the five Master Guilds? Which means if we lay a hand on him, we'll be picking a fight with the Union as well. We won't know the answer to that until we ask the Dawn. The Dawn is the boss of the Union, isn't he? Yep. Dawn Whitehorse, leader of Altos, the most powerful of the five master guilds. All right, let's go see what the Dawn has to say then. You know the way, right, Kel? I hey, wait. He's not the kind of person you can just meet. I don't really know if... Please? 
headquarters is in the north part of town. Doing? What? Uh, n nothing. Hmm? Well, well, if it ain't little Carol. What the hell are you thinking coming back here? Hey, what's with you? Yeah, I don't see Nan. She already did you? <laughs> no way. She wouldn't stop nagging, so I took off. This would explain why Carol wasn't too eager to go to Dongrist. So are you the latest guild to take him in? You could do a lot better than that, loser. All this kid can brag about is the number of guilds he's joined. Oh, right. That's a bad thing. Are these your friends, Carol? You could do a lot better than these losers. W what did you say? Such undignified men. Shut up. You sure have a way of saying things. I mean, you're right, but... Yeah, you just keep talking. What's that sound? Damn it. They're back again. Come on. The alarm. Monsters are here. Monsters? Wait, is this shaking the monster's footsteps? If so, they've brought quite an army. Yeah, but don't worry. Even if there have been a lot of monsters around here lately, our barrier here is strong, and it's never been broken before. And the guilds take care of the monsters outside the barrier. Huh? Oh, crap! The barrier... disappeared? What the hell is going on? The monsters are gonna get inside! Damn it, why do things like this always happen to me, no matter where I go? You gotta be cursed. Maybe. Yuri, we have to go stop the monsters. This is crazy. Where are all these monsters coming from? Something isn't right! Doesn't something seem different about the monsters as well? Here they come! Innocent waters! Uh, 
these things. do you? Those 
those guys to thank for the barrier Blastia failing on us. But why? Looks like you've got your hands full over here. So the Don's little lecture didn't stick? I'm just doing what I can to help. How's the repair of the barrier Blastia going? That'll depend on our genius mage here. The core is still there. They just fiddled with your formula a bit and stopped it, didn't they? What the? This is Anthos formula again. The same as they were using back on Emmett Hill. The barrier disappeared when the monsters attacked. It can't be a coincidence that they happened at the same time, can it? Probably not. So does your appearance here mean this is tied up with all the Empire's problems? I don't know. That's why I came here to check things out. That goes there, and this goes here. That's our Rita. All right, time to clean up the monsters outside the barrier. The guilds won't be able to complain if we fight monsters outside the city. We'll leave the monsters to Flynn. Let's go to the Union and ask about Barbos. You really trust Flynn, don't you? Only because there's no one else I can trust. That's how I look at it. Yuri, I don't get you sometimes. Dongress has a very different atmosphere from the capital, doesn't it? The city seems so energetic. Everyone here is so full of life. Of course. It's the largest guild city. Everyone lives according to their own principles. Do you like Dongrass, Estelle? Yes, I think it's lovely. What about you, Yuri? Hmm? I think it'd be a really great city if the barrier wasn't crapping out. Yuri, will you please let that go? I'm kidding. The city's not bad at all. It even feels kind of like the lower quarter. Talk to the Don about something. Help us out, could you? It's a matter that concerns the five master guilds. I haven't seen you around here recently. What guild do you belong to? We don't belong to a guild exactly. Unfortunately, the Don has left town in pursuit of the monsters. He went after the monsters? Yes. He plans on taking out the monster nests in one fell swoop. I see. Thanks for the information. No worries. If I went and helped them, I could prove myself to the Dawn. Oh well, shall we go look for that information in town? What? We're not going to help the Dawn? So you know where the monster nests are then? Oh, good point. Since it seems like you won't be making progress anytime soon, I'm gonna go check out Cave Mock. How selfish! I just want to get it out of the way as soon as possible. Then does that mean Estelle's going along with you? Yes. I told Alexei I was going to go after all. Don't worry. We'll be fine between the two of us. Sorry, afraid not. If you got hurt or anything, Flynn would hunt me down and kill me. You're gonna go, Yuri? Well, we don't really have any good leads around town that we're following anyway. Then it's decided. Let's go to the forest of... to Cave Mock, are they? What a coincidence. Come to think of it, why was Flynn and Dawn Grest? The Empire and the Union have never gotten along, so knights don't show up here often. I doubt they're here to see the sights either. It's gotta be tied up in one of their duties. Do you think Flynn's alright? 
But those guild people were being really mean to him. Flint's no delicate little flower. He can take some heat. Don't forget, before he was a knight, he had to make it on the streets of the lower quarter. I hope you're right. How many guilds are there in this city? I don't know the exact number, but I think there are more than a hundred. Whoa, that many? Are all of them in the Union? <clears throat> nah, not all of them, but I guess around 90% of them are Union members. Wow, and the Dawn's at the top of them all. That guy's amazing. That's why he's the Dawn! What are you so proud about? The Dawn's the amazing one, not you.
idea trees this big existed. Yeah, but it doesn't exactly look healthy for them to be this overgrown. It's just like you said, Carol. It's like what happened at Heliord when the Blastia went berserk. Be careful! There's somebody here! Hey! What a coincidence! What the hell are you doing in a place like this? You know, out for a forest stroll, taking in the nature. Something smells fishy. What? Where's my welcome? You didn't think we'd honestly be glad to see you, right? Ah, uh, you don't mean that. I can come in handy, you know. You're not thinking of coming with us, right? Of course. It's lonely being out here all by my lonesome. What? No dice? You'd better watch your back. If you try anything funny, you're dead. Hey, you don't really think my story stinks that bad, do you? Yeah, the stench is sort of coming off you in waves. Really? <laughs> I can't take responsibility for what I'll do if you make any sudden moves. Don't forget that. Controls the Union. What is Don Whitehorse like? In a word, big. Big voice, big body, big everything. We already know what he looks and sounds like. We saw him, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. Well, he's a really cool person. Does that answer your question, Estelle? It's clear that Carol has a lot of respect for the Don. But that's about the only thing that's clear. He's so cool that it can't be expressed in words. We'll just leave it at that then. much point in bringing it up again, but this guy's really fishy. Yeah, how long's he planning to stick with us anyway? Does he even have a good reason for being in Cave Mock? You heard him, old man. Spit it out. Huh? I'm gonna stick with you guys as long as need be. And as for my reasons, I thought I told you. I'm on a mission of self-discovery. You said you were out for a forest stroll, taken in the nature. Oh, I did? If I had a memory that bad, I'd want to find myself too. There you go. Really fishy. Really, really, really fishy. Let's get 
this over with. Just getting warmed up. I feel... tricks that'll convince us you're worth keeping around? Do I look like some kind of street magician to you? Hey, you! Come here a second. What? M me? Carol. No! Don't just leave me here! Show him what for, kid. Why me? Okay, this isn't funny anymore. Should be any minute now. Just wait for them to let their guard down, give them a little poke, and then BAM! Geez, I bet you're great at parties. I suppose that was good enough. Really? Yes. All right. Hey, you mean I passed? I can stay? Uh, are you kidding? It'll be much easier to do things to him if we keep him nearby. What do you mean? Things. Hadn't thought about that. Okay, I just got a little chill up my spine. Well then, Mr. Raven, after you. <laughs> right.
Wow, Carol, when you freak out, you really freak out. Come on, everyone has a few things they're afraid of, don't they? Not me. Now, now, genius mage, it's not nice to lie. Even old Raven's got his own fears. What are you afraid of, old man? I'm afraid of pretty girls. What? Yeah, yeah. Rita, it's better to come clean. That way we can help you out. Like anyone needs your help. I can take care of myself just fine. Her type always has some of the worst fears. Yeah, whatever.
Yeah, easy win. Thank you, thank you. This ain't a bad strategy either.
Just leave it to me. He hit it! Nice catch! Yeah? So you're still looking for Eifried's treasure? Eifried? Right. Treasure in a place like this? Who gave you that load of crap? The Map Baking Guild! World Seller tells me all sorts of things. After all, those lads travel all around the world. Is that why you went to Rago's mansion too? But... No, but a story that's 100% believable is all the more fishy. Hmm, I suppose that's true. Except that you're 100% fishy. Hey! No need to be mean now. Anyway, I've got to get back to my treasure hunting. If you keep wandering around all alone, you'll get attacked by monsters again. That monster didn't attack me. We were playing together. I don't think the monster saw it that way. Patty, behind you. I guess that means she'll be fine on her own. Will you come with me? I appreciate the offer, but treasure hunting will have to wait until another day. That's an awful shame, but nonetheless, I must go. Farewell! She's gone! Is she really gonna be okay? She said she'll be fine, so yeah, why not? I hope you're right. Still, it's not like worrying's gonna change anything. Come on, let's get going.